Legislative IQ. Increase your legislative intelligence with Florida's policy, budget, and campaign monitoring service. Subscribe today at legislativeiq.com. The majestic monarch, millions are on their way to Mexico, and year after year, one of their favorite resting places is here in St. Mark's along the Big Bend of Florida. Normally, the monarchs live just a month, but a hormone kicks in when the temperature drops, extending their life to seven or eight months, making the migration to Mexico possible. It's not one. Oh, no. The butterflies attracted these two Polk County high schoolers. They've been coming since 2012, conducting a science experiment. We can tag that one, then we haven't tagged that one. Measuring a protozone that caterpillars ingest from milkweed and then carry into adulthood as a butterfly. A lot of farmers are applying more pesticides and everything to their crops and killing milkweed because it is invasive. And so when there's no milkweed, they have nowhere to go, nowhere to eat. And without, like, the small areas of the food web and pollination stuff, we're not going to have what we can, so we need to do what we can to save our environment. In years past, these trees have actually appeared more black and orange than green. Cheryl Lachance says this year's crop is small, really small. See the canopy on this one here where you have a few of them? Yeah. Times it by about 20, 30. The butterflies return in the spring, lay their eggs, and then die, only to leave next year's migration to a new generation of monarchs. Reporting from St. Mark's Wildlife Refuge, I'm Mike Vasilenda.